Hello everyone, it's George and welcome back to Call of Dragons. As dedicated free to play player who played this game for more than one year, I'm excited to share some insider tips and tricks with you. Stick around and let's dive in. As you can see, we are on a season sub 2 and we are trying to get Elite Frost Giant, which is really really strong. We have tried a couple of times and everybody knows that whenever seasons are progressing, the behemoths are getting stronger and stronger and hopefully uh, this time we will be able to take it. Uh, so far the Frost Giant has 3.7 million HP with pretty strong mechanics and I hope uh, today will be the day whenever we will be able to take it. Uh, first phase is quite easy, there will be like some shards, uh, whenever there is a shard then some red circles you need to hide behind it. So far it's pure damage, um, it's pretty easy to understand that uh, it has two phases, one marksman phase and the last one mage phase. Uh, you should have like half marksmen and half mages in this kind of fights. So far we are doing absolutely fine but a most uh, uh, hard phase will start whenever the frost giant will start throwing some uh, snowballs and whenever snowball will hit anything which is on its way it will kill everybody so it's not that easy if it was easy we would, we would already have taken uh, in this fight we have couple of not couple of quite a lot of tier 5 players and hopefully uh, this time we will, we will be able to take it uh, as you can see we are trying to hide behind the shards so we won't gonna get any damage uh, which the giant will throw towards us uh, that's the main mechanic which the frost giant has uh, try to understand the shards try to not um, get hit by the snowball because it will simply destroy you with one hit uh, yeah right now the most important phase will start when a lot of legions are getting died uh, but so far we are doing absolutely fine uh, right now we need to have some shards uh, and a giant will be throwing the snowballs yeah as you can see uh, we will try to hide behind these shards so nobody will get targeted and get hit this is the moment when the frost giant is throwing the shard uh, we have quite a few amount of them currently uh, whenever you're gonna see this red line it means it's targeting you so try to avoid it uh, by standing uh, near the shards right right now i'm trying my best to move as fast as possible towards the shards so yeah you can see three legions died straight up uh, without any uh like anything like one hit one death uh, that's the idea behind uh, the giant and the most most strongest and strangest uh, mechanic which these uh, behemoths had so far yep okay, yet again one more legion died because of the snowball but yeah let's hope we will have enough uh, mages are really important in this kind of fights because at the end of the uh, fight uh, mages should be the ones who are dealing damage to the behemoths so far i'm on a certainty that if we're gonna consider that uh, we have quite a lot of tier 5 players in this fight and that's a quite a good amount of damage which i'm doing right now as i have mentioned i am a free to play player i have not spent a single dollar in this game and even participating in this kind of uh, fights is really really interesting and really really fun for me uh, yeah, once again throwing some snowballs that's pretty easy to dodge because there is a big red circle that notifies you that snowball will be thrown to that direction uh, 2 million HP is left um, and uh, we have like approximately couple of minutes and until it will get enraged then whenever behemoth is enraged it's impossible to kill it because it's one shots everybody right we are we're going to the second phase, um, it's building up some shards, uh, soon it will throw everybody away and then next snowball uh, phase will be starting. Uh, I'm getting higher in terms of damage, 11, um, quite good, uh, and 1.5 million HP is left. Um, I think we are going to take it, uh, but let's see, uh, let's see, I will try my best to hide behind this shard. Uh, which is here 
and I hope I actually did it right. Well, I did not because I got hit by that and my legion is almost gone. I hope I will take this healing um, shard which gonna heal me but yeah, everybody is taking it. Yeah, let's move away because there is a big red circle, a big white circle which gonna deal damage. Yeah, finally we are getting some heals, uh, but yeah, I got a quite a big amount of damage towards myself uh, during that fight, right? So let's just move back, uh, let's try to deal damage also. And I'm always like to stay close to shard because I never know when I have to do that to hide behind it, right? And yeah, everybody is moving it straw towards shard. Let's move towards there. I actually thought I was quite safe uh, in that location because um, yeah, I had shard towards myself and it should have been easy uh, for me to avoid that attack. But yeah, nevertheless, uh, we are quite close to killing the, the first giant right now. I will try my best to use artifact. Yeah, the position of the shards are quite good. Uh, it will be easy for us to not get hit by the snowball because we have quite a lot of them. That's like generally the main idea about the uh, frost giant fight. Just use shards, avoid the attacks, you have red circle, uh, stay behind the shard so the snowball will hit the shard and not hit you, right? Okay, let's move up. Okay, this will be hard, let's just not go, yeah, this guy is trying to kill us, but let's just avoid it, yeah, yeah, that's the gameplay behind the whole thing, uh, I really think that we will be able to take the giant um, at this time, um, it's our like third or fourth uh, try, but finally I guess we have enough uh, strong mages, and yeah, this snowball might just destroy us if we won't gonna move away, yeah, 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 finally. Let's go and take some heals because we are low on health. Yeah, I just got a little bit of them. Yeah, this is the last phase. Um, now we should be able to take it. Don't get me wrong, this is not the easy fight. It's Elite 1 on Season Sob 2. And we have like 55 seconds in order to just destroy this uh, Frost Giant. And uh, hopefully we will have enough time. Um, and right now nobody should be trying to get the Healing Stone. Because yeah, we just don't have uh, time to... Uh, do anything else rather than just the deal damage right i guess right now we need to be uh we need to have more mages because mages are dealing the most damage right now unfortunately we have uh, missing seven players but yeah let's see uh this is quite close 21 seconds uh, this might be impossible so uh we are going to run away because yeah like as I have mentioned, every single legion which uh, is participating in this elite raid uh, is really important simply because every legion needs to be dealing damage because you can see uh, we just missed on so little, it was so hard to get it. I hope um, uh, this video will be helpful for you, 100% um, you need to have tier 5 players in order to get uh, the elite frost giant because it's not an easy fight um, longer the game longer you are playing more you are playing uh, this game more seasons you are playing it's getting harder and harder to uh, get the elite ones especially and for the frost giant uh, this is the mechanic a snowball is important mechanic to know and to understand shards is really really important because if you are not hiding behind your shards you are getting killed then you are making it it's dangerous to your alliance members to do anything during the battlefield unfortunately we were not able to get it uh, we will try it a couple of times hopefully um, at some point we will be able to take it but uh, simply because of the mechanics was shown um, by the everyone uh, and you guys will be will understand how to move how to not get hit by the projectiles which the frost giant is hitting i will be still posting this video because uh, this kind of videos is all about to understand what to avoid, how what are the mechanics, especially for the elite ones, right? 
I hope it was um, helpful for you. I hope um, everybody will take the Elite Cross Giants and everybody will have their uh, frames because, yeah, uh, killing behemoths is a part of the game. Uh, it's a part of the fun which Call of Dragons is bringing to us. Um, thanks for watching. Um, I hope next um, behemoth videos I will be taking, we will be able to capture it. But whole idea behind this video is to understand um, how to take it, what to miss, um, how in general, what kind of mechanics the giants has or in general behemoth has. Um, if you like the video, press like, subscribe, share, it always gives me more and more motivation to make more content for this game. And as always, everybody, I hope you guys will have amazing day, morning or night, wherever you are. We're gonna see each other very, very soon. Bye bye and good luck.